As I said in my full review, MSI Creator 15 OLED comes only with 16 gigs of RAM, which is extremely weird considering that the laptop is having the word Creator in its name. I was having problems deflickering some footage in DaVinci Resolve, the program would just scream that GPU memory is not enough and then crash successfully. <laughs> the laptop has only 6 gigs of VRAM. And then Windows using half of the laptop's actual RAM as a video memory, which is called shared memory at this point. So decisions were made, money were spent. As a victim, I chose a cute little kit of two 32 gig sticks called Kingston Fury. It works on 3200 MHz out of the box without a need to set anything in the BIOS, which is Nice, because a lot of laptops wouldn't allow you to set anything in the BIOS in the first place. So here it is out of the box experience, let's say so. And now you probably expect to see some big improvements in benchmarks compared to the stock RAM. There is no any. This Kingston Fury kit performs exactly the same as the stock RAM installed in MSI Cray 15 OLED. At this point you might say that this upgrade doesn't make any sense at all. And I would agree with you. But not, not this time. time. Occasional performance drops or stutters which are happening when the RAM is full and stuff is being written to the SSD. With 16 gigs of RAM if you are not just browsing the web but really use the laptop to do some work on those stutters are happening all the time. For the context, here are some screenshots of memory usage. Turned out I actually need about 30 gigs of RAM and occasionally even 50 to comfortably use the laptop. And if you want to tell me that not all the people need that much of RAM, then you again forgetting the fact that it's a creator's laptop and the more RAM is better. And with 64 gigs of RAM, I don't remember having any stutters anymore. The laptop is working just fine. As fine as the Windows laptop can work, of course. I can run as much stuff as I need at the same time without worrying that the computer will suffocate. I don't usually like, should you buy X? Should you get Z? Like, fuck would I know what should you do? But this time is actually different if you already bought the laptop with the word creator in its name and it's having only those pathetic 16 gigs of RAM then yes you probably should perform this upgrade and if you want to make sure ADA64 can help you with that just run it do your regular work on it and you'll see the exact amount of memory you're going to be comfortable with after upgrading you will forget about those stutters completely and the laptop will feel nicer and going to work better. And of course your SSD will live longer as a bonus. Thank you for watching.